Our outcomes do not determine whether we've been successful or not. And they're not a reason to stop pursuing. And here's what I mean by that. When we have a target, we've identified what exactly we want, what that target needs to be, and really identified what that is and created an, a plan that we need to execute on, so often we get fixated on the outcomes that come from those actions. And if maybe they're unfavorable to what we wanted, they cause us to stop. They cause us to get frustrated. They cause us to move from that performance state to that primitive state where we're anxious and angry and bitter and we lose all that creative energy and we give all of our energy away. So we need to become disconnected from the outcome. We need to be so solely focused on the target that we do not worry about what that outcome is, but rather the execution on the actual actions. And by doing that, and actually focusing strictly on the out or strictly on the actions that get to our certain outcomes, we can start to create this clarity. Because what happens is so often we stop what we're doing because we don't know how to get to the next thing. Or we uh, get this feedback and we're like, oh, I guess I've tried everything. I, I've, I've tried a million things and nothing's working. Well, have you really tried a million things? Have you really executed on the plan you put forward? No, you've probably tried the same thing over and over again, gotten the same outcome and said, oh, I, nothing works, I'm, I'm done. So what we need to do is we need to execute on our plan continually and take what we're actually wanting out of it. I go back to like my homeless man story where his, his objective, his target was to get food. Okay, his, he was on the train, he was begging for food, and I came up to him, I said, yeah, let's go walk, and we're gonna, I'm gonna go buy you a meal. So we start walking, and I said to him, what was your, what, what do you want, what can I get for you? And he goes, I don't know anything. So I offer him a coffee shop here where we could get him a bunch, where so we can get him some breakfast sandwiches and some coffee. No, no, I don't want that. Okay, I, we walk by a pizza joint. I'll give you, get you a, a whole pizza you can take and have with you. No, I don't want that either. Well, all of a sudden, he was sitting there and he, he knew what his target was, he wanted to get there, but he hasn't executed on the plan. He hasn't, he hasn't put anything forward for me to be able to act to give him ultimately what he wants. So we need to stay focused on execution of the plan. We need to stay focused on those mini movements. And you know what? Yeah, some are gonna fail. You're gonna fail more often than you're gonna succeed. But again, if you've watched my past videos, those failures are not failures. They're learning experiences, they're moments that you can build upon yourself, and they're moments that you can take in to reroute what it is that you're doing to make sure that your action plan is as detailed and as, and as action-oriented as possible. And we forget about the outcomes. We detach ourselves from the outcomes. And we put ourselves in the point of action. We give ourselves that distinct plan, that purpose that's going towards that target of where we want to go and we're clear on that. Because the moment we become clear, it activates those neurosynaptic connections that allow us to be open and see the opportunity that we can act and can make steps that are going to produce different results for us. So do not worry about the outcomes. Don't be focused on those. Focus on execution of the plan and do it with every single ounce that you have. Do it with your energy, do it with your purpose, do it with your focus, and ultimately give your heart to that. Because when you focus on that plan, you focus on that action step, and you focus on doing exactly what it is that you need to do, those outcomes that you're desiring are gonna happen. But we need to focus on the follow through and the execution of that plan. Go own it.